Hello everyone, this is Mad Cat Steer, and I wanted to upload a video to talk about something um, very truthful. Um, I wanted to talk about the fact that um, how a lot of people have a lot of trouble um, you know, developing their psychokinesis and their telekinetic abilities. I just wanted to let you guys know that, uh, that at the end of the day, it doesn't really matter if you develop your abilities or not. And I've talked about this a lot in my other um, videos, if you haven't caught on to it. Um, the thing is though is that what really matters is that you're a good individual, you're a good person, and you retain all your dignity of who you are. Um, I always talk about, um, because like the, the thing is though is that we as humans, um, you know, for like about a hundred years, we probably lost our ability to do psychokinesis abilities and to speak with the spiritual realm. You know, we we forgot ourselves. We've been on the earth for like a thousands and thousands of years. I don't know what happened. I don't know what's going on. I don't know what occurred. You know, but I think that we were able to communicate with our spiritual lives and and to speak with and to be able to develop our psycho psychokinesis very easily amongst each other in communities. But the thing is, though, is that what I want to get at is that uh, you don't have to worry about uh, trying to prove yourself to others. And to develop your psychokinesis, you know, uh, don't worry about, um, you know, rushing to develop it. Don't worry about being left behind, because the thing is, though, is that for the last hundred years, people have been just living, just living. You know, they've just been living, and living the way that they know best. You know, they're not perfect. You know, some people drink a lot. You know, some people they eat a lot. They're they're gluttons. You know, they smoke a lot they uh they're lazy or whatever it doesn't really matter how you how you live as long as you're a good individual and what i'm trying to get at is that is that people have been you know what matters is that you're a good individual and you treat yourself with respect the best that you can and you treat uh your fellow neighbors and your fellow you know a fellowship of your of your own race you know the people on earth the people that you know on streets and and whatever acquaintances you treat them with respect you know because people have been living without the ability you know people have been living without the without knowing how to perform psychokinesis for like hundreds of years but they've been but they've been but but they're still good people and they're still powerful you know and that as long as they show some genuineness and they show love and they show gratitude to people that have done them good that's all that matters that's all it that really matters Psychokinesis is just is just an ability that it's just something that 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 you can do. If you can do it, then good. If you can't, then it's good, equally good. You know, it's it's awesome to be able to control something with your mind. It's awesome to be able to control something without touching it. That's what psychokinesis. That's the magic of it. But what it's supposed to do is supposed to is supposed to re re um reinvigorate re. Uh, 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 start that flame again, you know, just reignite the enlightenment of yourself. That's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to, because, you know, psychokinesis is supposed to be thought of something impossible. You know, something that's impossible. I remember watching videos, you know, when I was a child and watching movies. I never thought twice about it. I never thought twice about psychokinesis. I never thought, I thought it was just something that was just, just in movies and stuff like that. And, sorry, but. You know, and then now that I'm able to do it, and I and I understand it, and I'm able to have the pleasure of sharing it with you, to teach you, it's just an amazing, extraordinary thing. You know, it, 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 as long as we're passing on the message to others that we are able to to teach others this enlightening thing, to to empower them to be wild by earth, to be wild and to be inspired by life, to be inspired by by life to be inspired you know that's what that's what psychokinesis is supposed to empower you and, and to and, and to oh, awaken the, your heart to believe you know that that's what psychokinesis is that's what it's all about and and if you can do it or if you can't do it then it's all good in the end because we're all powerful what it is is that when you're a spirit and when you die you go up to heaven you're you, you can do all these things at a whim 
at a win, you can do it all, all, all very easily. You know, you do it very easily up in heaven. You know, it's like it's it's like nothing. But here in this in the simulation in this world that we're in, in the living bodies, what it is is that the whole thing is just for us to rediscover that we're powerful, to 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 rediscover that that we're infinite and that we're powerful. And it's just a game. It's just a learning process. When when you die, you escape the the fickleness of this life, the fickleness and the and the tittle tap kind of little um little, little things. It's just, just like it's all like you know. It's just like the like the like the sensitivities of of, of uh, the the argumentative, the very biased kind of you know very you know the the ugliness you know the, the social ugliness thing you know that life is about you know the, the 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 internal and external problems that occur. You know, all, all, all that stuff, you know, it, it it's all there for a learning experience. And that's what life is, but but the real reality is when you're dead. That that's the real reality. We're all powerful and we're all equal. Like maybe someone can do something more better than you, but when you die you you could learn that and have it and you can do it just as well. You know? And there's other al alternate realities in which you can explore when you're dead. When you're when you're a spirit you can explore the universe. But you have to know that those options are there when you know because that's why a lot of spirits that I wanted to get at too is that a lot of spirits they're so stuck in their past life uh, situation that they stick around which is completely unnecessary they stick around in the past life and they just wander around on earth and and, and they ignore the angels or they ignore the beckoning of the light there. I, I, like I don't know what's going on and not even the mediums know you know like no, nobody really knows and uh, until you're there then you know you know until you're dead real dead and your body's in the ground and you're floating around only when only then will you know what's going on but then you can't pass the message on because everybody is just stuck in their own mind and they, 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 they can't receive the signals your, your, you know the message your, your messages but the thing is, is though, is that, is that, um, you know, don't worry about trying to prove yourself, because you already are great. We're all great. It's hard to fathom, but we're all infinite. We're all great, and and we chose to be in this this thing, you know, this game thing, because we we wanted to experience like the having limitations, you know. And 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 the thing is though, is that it's just a very uh. Um, sensitive topic and and uh, we've all lost somebody we've all lost family members we've all lost people it's a very sensitive thing <coughs> but man the, the thing is those we, we have nothing to worry about I keep on talking about that but it's the truth we really don't have nothing to worry about you know don't worry about developing psychic needs don't worry about you know if some like 20 years from now there's like you know your your neighbors or your school chums or your college. You know everybody's gonna learn psychokinesis in the future. Everybody's gonna realize it's real. But the thing is, those don't worry about if they're better than you. They're better than you. It, it doesn't matter what they do, per se. It doesn't matter what they do, whether it's psychokinesis, sports, or whatever. They're better at you at playing the life, the game of life. That's what it is. They're better than you at this at this game. This game of the living life, the game of life, they're better at you at certain things in the game, the structure of the game. But when you pass away, everyone is equal and equally powerful, you know. And I'm pretty sure that each individual on Earth has has uh, um, ventured into different realms of universes, spoken to aliens, spoken to different transdimensional beings. They 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 spent eons and hundreds of years, millions of years wandering around before you you did that all before you became who you are you know you spent thousands of years wandering the universe exploring and learning experiencing things before you became who you are you were you were always powerful we we're all powerful this is just a uh like trevor seven said it's an avatar it's a temporary ride that's what it is it's a temporary thing you can make it go on and on if you want but it's all up to you. But when you die, don't worry about it. And don't worry about developing the psychokinesis. Do it if you can. It does take a lot of focus and a lot of dedication on your part 
I understand that because I do it. It does take a lot of dedication, but if you cannot do it, take your time and don't push yourself and don't worry about being left behind. Because I can is about self-development. This game of life is about learning individuals, our individual self, learning about our individual selves. The game of life is about self-discovery of self, of individual people's, individual spirits learning about themselves in this, in this limited world. That's what the game is. You win when you discover who you are. You win the game. Even when you, it, even when you don't discover, even when you learn something, at least if you learn something when you die, you, you win. You win the game when you discover something about yourself or something about a different perception or different angle of looking at life when you pass away. You win the game. That's what the game is. And this is Ricky Cespedes. Mad Cat Spear, sorry. My alias. Thank you guys for watching. God bless.